The Nashville community remembering beloved TSU football player Chazon Page, the college senior crossing Gallatin Pike early Sunday morning when a driver hit and killed him. Police are still looking for the suspect. But before Page ever got to TSU, he was a star athlete at Lipscomb Academy. News 2's Nikki McGee has more from one of his high school coaches on the legacy he leaves behind. No matter what I was going through or any coach was going through, um, the minute Chazon smiled, you just understood the type of kid that he was. Lipscomb Academy head football coach Jamie Graham never imagined when he met Rico Page while growing up in Nashville that decades later he'd be coaching his son Chazon. And it's an experience Graham calls a privilege. Even if you met him for two seconds or if you've known him for 20 years, no matter what it was, you were able to understand the type of person that Chazon was. And it's good because his legacy is much bigger than football. It has nothing to do with football. But unfortunately, the now TSU offensive lineman's life was cut short Sunday morning. Metro Police say Chazon was crossing Gallatin Pike when he was hit and killed by a driver. As timing would have it, Graham, who just returned to Lipscomb Academy's football staff, recalls talking with coaches a few weeks ago, looking to design murals with some of their most iconic alumni. I was like, man, there are some guys that are very, very important to this program. And so um, the first thing I called Patrick Carpenter, I was like, Patrick, I have we like we have to get Chase on on one of these pictures. Now, as of last week, Chazon's photo is featured in their training facility. It means even more now um, because I, there was a reason why I didn't call him. I didn't call him because I wanted to surprise him in person because I knew he would be working out over here with, with King Dunlap downstairs. And I was just like, man, I'm going to grab him. And I'm going to show him his picture and show him that he's on the wall. And so, you know, it hurts a lot, actually, um, because I'm not able to show him. But it's a reminder Graham will now pass every day. Chazon was the ultimate competitor. He was working towards something that was positive, working towards something that was going to better his life. I think he had a chance of going to the NFL. I think he had a chance of being a professional in whatever he did. And so it's, it's, it's very sad to know that he's not able to live out his dream. Um, but he touched so many people that I think we can kind of um, allow his legacy to live on no matter how long it is. Now, police are still looking for the driver in this case. If you have any information, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at 615-74-CRIME.